All right, guys, so we're back yet again doing what we do. And we're going to be looking at green cards this time. And once again, I will say it is the 15th, otherwise known as a Monday. And if you're watching this in days ahead, that's because I don't want to spam you with videos. So anyway, uh, these are the green creatures for uh, our green spells from Magic Origins that have so far been spoiled and only confirmed because I don't like looking at unconfirmed stuff because I don't want to trick anybody. So we're starting off with Elvish Visionary, one in a green creature, Elf Shaman. When Elvish Visionary enters the battlefield, draw a card, 1-1. One, one. Very good standard, I shouldn't say standard material card, but it's a standard card that's been in a lot of sets and you're going to love her for... Uh, a lot of different kind of play style or play styles, casuals as well, as well as limited, very amazing limited card. Leaf Glider, Gilder. It's a Gilder. I almost said it's a glider. It's not a glider. It's Gilder. For one in a green, it is a 2-1 who taps for a green mana because you want the 2-1 instead of the 1-1 one one who does the same thing for one. Except we don't. Give me Elvis Mystic. Go away. Go away, Leaf Gilder. We didn't like you the first time. We don't like you now. Titanic Growth. One and a green. Instant. Target creature gets plus four, plus four until end of turn because we can't get giant growth for some reason. Vastwood Gorger. Five and a green. Creature Worm. Five, six. Vanilla as fuck. And not amazing for green. We'd expect better for green. I'm sorry. Yeva's Force Mage, two and a green, creature elf shaman. When the Force Mage enters the battlefield, target creature gets plus two, plus two, until end of turn. Uh, pretty decent, isn't it? Pretty decent. It's almost like for that one extra mana, you get not Giant's Growth, but the other one I can't think of right now. Conclave Naturalist, four and a green for a creature dryad. They enter the battlefield, you may destroy target, artifact, or enchantment. It's okay. The other elf is better. That does the same thing. Hits Claw Recluse. Two and a green. Creature spider with reach and a 1-4. And it has grabby hands. It can grab you. What the fuck? Gross! Juraga Invocation, four and double green. Each creature you control gets plus three, plus three until end of turn and must be blocked this turn if able. Interesting ability to wait to board wipe your opponent, maybe, but, ugh. I mean, it's a good way to deal with tokens, but this is like the token deck color, so I don't, I don't know, man. It's interesting, I guess. Uh, so we're looking at Mantle of Webs, one and a green enchant creature. Enchanted creature gets plus one, plus three, and reach. That's pretty okay. Getting reach is pretty okay in green, I gotta say. Uh, Nissa Sage Animist, this is a card I have previously talked about on my channel. And if you want to check that out, please go look at it. And um, she's good. I like her. She's Borderland Ranger with uh, Transform. Then we have Plummet, uh, one in a green, to instant destroy target creature with flying. A very amazing green sideboard guard. In limited. Prize Unicorn, three in a green creature unicorn. All creatures are able to block prize unicorn do so. Two, two. Because we can't have Elvish Taunter. Alright, so Terra Stomper. Three and triple green. That equals six mana, people. For an 8-8 eight, eight creature, beast, relevant subtype. Can't be countered. Has trample. A good creed and creature card in this set. It's amazing. How does this exist in this set? A good green creature card? Whoa!